Stephen Murray confessed to murdering Father Rene Robert. The killing shocked our entire community back in April of 2016. And Joy is here now with a police interrogation video News 4 Jackson just obtained. Joy? Mary, on this video, you can hear Murray explaining to police that not being allowed by family to see his own children really took a toll on him, making him reckless. His confession on video said very quietly, but very matter-of-factly. I could have got away with the murder, but I just kept my mom sick. Mm -hmm. Stephen Murray confessing to detectives on video that he kidnapped and murdered St. Augustine priest Father Rene Robert before dumping his body in Georgia in April of 2016. As he drove Father Rene's car, Murray says the priest called out to him from the trunk. I'm riding, you know, and Father Rene is talking to me and telling me, you know, he's never going to get away with this, you know, you're never going to get away with this, you know. And I had no intention of hurting him. Mm -hmm. no one's was he still in the trunk then? Yeah. Murray goes on to reveal that when he finally stopped in that remote area of Georgia and let Father Rene out of the trunk to use the bathroom, Murray killed him right there. Over in that spot where y'all got him from, you know, and I backed up right there and he said he had to use the bathroom, you know, so I was going to let him out and use the bathroom. And Murray even tells detectives how and why he should pay for his crime. It doesn't make sense of this, you know, but you can't. You know, the damage is done. And I just really hope y'all kill me for it, you know what I mean? In court, Stephen Murray pleaded guilty to the murder and was sentenced to life in prison without parole. Father Rene had signed a declaration back in 1995 asking if he were ever killed that his murder not receive the death penalty. For more details about the events before and after the priest's murder, how Murray was caught and his trial, look for this story on newsforjax.com.